But ever since I started following your plan, I haven't had a single migraine. And I try and tell people every freaking day, change. I, mean, I am amazed. You have no idea how grateful I am for that. Because I was at a point where I'm like, I just want to die. I just want to die. This is no worth. This is no way of living. And, it's, and people it, didn't understood it. It's like you have everything. Yes, you can have material stuff, but that's not everything. I don't feel good. It's life changing. When you change the way you eat, it will absolutely change your life. And people don't realize I that. Back. I would never go back. And I keep trying to, uh, nobody, nobody in my household is overweight by any means. Everybody works out, everybody is really fit. My husband, who is 51, looks better than I think when we married. <laughs> I love that. And, you know, yes, but, uh, but still, I'm trying to still tell them, uh, my, my son does eat very healthy. So he's eating like me, but I'm trying to tell my husband, look, you look this good. With just eating kind of regular stuff, what if you cut out this little thing? You would look even better. <laughs> just, just saying, you know, you can never look too good. Oh, for sure, you could always improve somewhere. But that's awesome. That's that's literally music to my ears. And people ask me all the time, like, why do I do this for free? Why do I do one-on-one -on -one calls? Why do I give my plan away for free? This exact reason. You, I was yeah. a part of you changing your life and not having migraines. I did something to help somebody in this world. Me. My friend tried to discourage me. As soon as I told her about it, I was so excited talking about you. And I call you my coach, which is funny. Because, I mean, and then I'm like, well, he's not my coach. Hey, I, I absolutely him. am, girl, 100%. <laughs> and I was so excited. And she's like, well, sorry to tell you, it's not going to work. And I even messaged you on Instagram, I believe. And you responded to me. She, you're like, oh, no, it's just because she can't change. And so I keep telling her, okay, I lost another two inches from my waist, and I lost another two inches, like, from my, like, my chest area. I mean, it's just, it's just amazing. It's just amazing at how good I feel. I cannot thank you enough, because the migraine is something that I have spent so much money and in gadgets, try every, every treatment that's possible. I mean, my husband at one point told me, you have all the gadgets on earth to try to help you with your minors, but that was the desperation that I was in. And um, I'm just so grateful, very, very grateful. Hey, just be happy that you actually made the change. You don't understand. You could have kept scrolling. You didn't have to watch. You didn't have to go and actually start the plan, but you did. You made the change. And you day by day, did, meal yeah. by meal, do it. And now you're- and you know what? I don't even feel tempted. Like my husband, the other day he brought like a lot of sweet bread. We're Mexican, okay? So he brought like sweet bread and there was cake and it was in front of me. I didn't even touch it. I was like, nope. It's because nope. of the why. And it's the same reason why I don't drink. Like the hangover yeah. sucks. Nope, I won't do it. I won't do it. I gotta admit though, one day I did have, um, it's kind of like this, specialty Mexican cookies that my mother-in-law brought from Mexico. And I was having a really stressful day. And I was like, why not just give in? You been so good. Not as a, not as a price, but I just kind of had one of those days and I was like, after this, uh, you know, I'll get right back on the horse. I will continue eating right. Yep. And the next day, I actually had a migraine. I like, I have had one migraine, but it was because I ate that. And it was one little thing. And it's like, I know this is what's killing, what was killing me? The sugars, the carbohydrates, the bad ones, of course. It's, it's all the stuff processed from boxes, box food, pros, like, shoot, now you go to the grocery store, you have genetically modified, you got, what is it, what did I, what's that word called? It was something with the rice. I found out today when I looked at rice. Um, Bioengineered rice, that's what it said. Oh Bioengineered ingredients in the bag of white rice. Wow. Yeah, it's and that's the thing. That's why I try and tell people just eat real food, stop buying all these products, and to knock that one out of the park again with your friend who's the naysayer. It's so true. People will never have your back who can't do what you're doing getting results. If you go to talk to a millionaire 
and say, hey, I wanna start a business, this is my idea, the millionaire ain't gonna bash you, but you go tell your friend who's broke, has no money, hates their job, you tell them about starting a business, they're gonna tell you you're dumb, you don't know what you're doing, it'll never work. It's the same thing with weight loss. You tell your friend how excited you are about getting results, they'll tell you it's never gonna work and you're gonna gain all your weight back. It's because they can't do it. Yeah, well, thank you so much. And um, hopefully I'll get there and I'll be sure to give you another call and submit pictures because I have a good feeling this is, is going to work out. Hell yeah, it's going to work out. That's why it was funny when you called. You're like, you're like, I don't think I'm taking the right amount of calories, but I'm losing weight and dropping inches, but it's not right. So 100%. Yeah, I, I, you know, I'm just working out. I want to be really toned. I mean, I... I I don't really see a lot of definition in my body. Um, I kind of gained the weight in the last few years. I had a lot of things going on in my life, personal situation with my parents. I lost both of my parents uh, in the last three years. And back to back, my mom had cancer between that. She suffered throughout. And I topped that off with being premenopausal, having had migraines for, I mean, now it's seven, seven years, but back then it was four and a half years. It was just... I felt like I was at the bottom of the hole. And um, I just, I think it was just all the stress and combined with everything that it just, I just literally like got really big, like not so much in weight, but I looked like I was really inflamed. But, uh, you know, I want to have like a really nice physique. That's my goal, you know, to get there to like, by the time I'm 50, okay, I'm gonna look better than I, I'm, I have never been really overweight, but I want to look better than I did when I was on my 20s. Hey, That's and my goal. that I love, I absolutely love that. When people in their 30, in their 40s and 50s look better than they did in their 30s. I'm gonna prove everybody wrong and then I'll give you a call and then I'll show you the pictures. Let's do it, girl. I like it, seriously. I'm so happy you started and freaking it makes me so happy that just changing your nutrition made your migraines literally disappear yes yes well, well thank you so much i'll let you go uh i'm sure somebody else needs help hey i appreciate a ton for calling seriously have an amazing night all right you too all bye. right bye-bye let's go ladies and gents change nutrition she said she had migraines for the last seven years they're gone one month Changing nutrition, taking in the right amount of calories, ladies and gents. I don't know what else to tell you guys. Just start. 